hi welcome back to rebecca's travels so if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to rebecca's lifestyle hi ha, how are you all doing i hope everybody's as well as possible and um, if you're new to my hit uh, channel as uh, please subscribe um i would love more subscribers on both my travel and my lifestyle channel and a big thumbs up and thank you for doing that um Today I'm going to be doing Budget Travel News Special uh, 10 Exciting Facts 2023 uh, Part 4 and this is according to uh, BudgetTravel.com um, Number 1 KayakBooking.com and American Express um, have all recently released their reports on uh, travel trends uh, for the upcoming year and uh, several other large companies as well um, and again kayak booking.com american express are um, good uh, good ways to um, again save money um, in regards to travel and uh, number two is this year's um, off season may be a little busier than last year's while uh, the summer may be somewhat uh, quieter than usual um, off peak um, is generally uh, cheaper than peak so a lot a lot of people if they can travel off peak will travel off pe peak and um, because obviously it's a lot cheaper than in peak and um number three um off the grid travel takes priority however almost half 48 percent would only consider going off the grid if it meant they could take a few luxuries and indulgences with them and 53 percent um uh, revealed they um would need their phone and um, stable internet connection and then they'd be prepared to uh, travel off uh, grid and um, again tra um, off grid uh, travel um, like um, going on um, a campsite or um, not touristy destinations um, is uh, cheaper uh, than tra uh, traveling to the big tourist hotspots um, etc and um, especially lesser known countries um, uh, there and islands are cheaper than well-known countries and islands if you get what i mean um and um number four um the appeal of culture shock almost three quarters 73 percent of the survey surveyed by booking.com at uh, one to experience travel out of the comfort zone with 30 percent uh, keen to explore lesser known cities to find um, hidden gems again um, it's also cheaper to uh, travel to lesser known cities um, than say capital cities of countries um, we're uh, generally um travelers also want to experience a, an authentic experience that uh, will give them a taste of local culture and um for that uh, them to explore hidden gems that their friends back home don't even know about um so actually um on holiday um when i first went to uh, Co costa brava um my dad hired a car on one of those places um 
in like the Costa uh, Brava, Costa Calada, um, is um, a city called Garucha or a town called Garucha and um, again it wasn't even on the map but when we co uh, come to it it said Garucha and it wasn't even on the map so again it's exploring and that was um, in Spain and that's and that's what we again like to do um, or at least on uh, that holiday um, and it was a lot cheaper than going to the touristy parts um, of the Costa de, uh, de Brava and uh, mainland Spain is uh, cheaper than let's uh, say the Balearic Islands and the Canary Islands uh, for example so and um, again you get more of a taste um, of what the locals do uh, there so um, and it was really nice to explore and number five um, Nos Elegic Escapes Make a Comeback and um, it's not all about the unusual and the unfamiliar though um, especially when it comes to um, cl uh, classic trips like uh, say day trips or simple uh, beach uh, getaways road trips and theme park trips um, may see uh, resurgence so and like country parks and places like that um, uh, they may seem uh, see resurgence um, and number six um, half 54% uh, planning on taking a family reunion focused a vacation that means um, theme parks such as Universal Orlando Resort or Autumn Towers in the UK Drayton Manor Park at Thorpe Park uh, may be visited um, by multi-generation family um, traveling in groups is always cheaper um, and all and staying with family is always cheaper and um, and because you're saving up on accommodation all you have to do is pay for um your flights and um that's why a lot of people stay with family um when if they uh, live away from family um on holiday and uh, number seven um back to basic experience many travelers and um, express a desire to use their va vacation uh, this year in 2003 um, or in general as an opportunity to learn survival skills at 58 percent um, at camping according to booking.com this includes learning how to source clean water light a fire from scratch forage for food and um, in the wilds and um, in the wild and um, how to prep for an apocalypse uh, so um, a, a good 58% prefer that and again that again is a lot cheaper uh, vacation um, to go uh, to go on um, and to consider and uh, number eight uh, connecting with nature and um, also tops uh, travelers with wish list uh, sitting in front of a co cozy uh, crackling fireplace somewhere in deep in the woods etc is many travelers um, idea of bliss and um, that's camping um, whether it's wild ca uh, camping or camping with a tent 
and at number nine um 61 percent of people in intend on planning a vacation at further in advance um uh, obviously there's more on offer and it is generally cheaper um so it, um but again some travelers still want to book last minute and um, but if you do book la at last minute then there's less choice available and um it is generally more expensive in the long run um not always but it generally it's more expensive um last but not least the finest fabulous fact number 10 88 percent of all respondents agreed that dining and shopping at a local um small business brings a more authentic experience and um, is cheaper and um, so again a shopping say at a market or a discount store um again is generally uh, cheaper than um it's it shopping at say large at stores especially like department stores or uh, or large food chains and um, etc so um i would like to say thank you for watching and um i'll see you tomorrow um for an another iceland update this time i know um exactly when it's going to be opening in my town in colville so i would like to say thank you for watching and i hope uh, you have a as good day or night wherever you are in the world and thank you and bye for now thank you bye